Hello and welcome to this video. In this Photoshop tutorial, we are going to learn how to create realistic glass morphism. In this video, I will be showing you the step-by-step -step instructions on how to create a stunning glass effect that will make your designs truly stand out. So let's get started. Let's begin by opening our image. The image I used can be downloaded from the link in the description. Convert the image to a smart object and rename it as background. After that, duplicate the layer and name the copy as foreground. Now, apply a Gaussian blur filter to the foreground layer. Set the blur radius to 22 and click on OK. Turn off the foreground layer and draw a rounded rectangle below it using the rounded rectangle tool. Good. Now clip the foreground layer to the rectangle and turn the visibility back on. Our glass morphism is almost looking good. Now let's play around with the blending options to give it a more realistic feel. First, we will select the stroke and adjust the settings. Set the color to white and size to 3. After that, reduce the opacity to around 27. Let's go ahead and add an inner glow. You can use my settings or experiment with your own. Lastly, let's add a drop shadow. Adjust the angle and opacity and click on OK to confirm. Perfect. It's time to add the UI elements. Go ahead and open the UI elements. You can download this one as well from the link in the description. Drag the UI elements onto your work document and adjust the size to fit the glass. The glass morphism is now ready. You can change the image to anything since we converted it at the beginning into a smart object. If you want to change the image, just double click on the smart object to open the image in another window. Place your new image and save it to apply the changes. There you have it. I hope this tutorial was helpful. Smash the like button and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. I will see you in the next one.